first time we have been given access to the Guild Hall, the building you see behind me. This is where merchants, traders, magistrates and councillors met. And I cannot wait to go inside. If you have a look at these pillars, take a closer look. There's a small little gap between the ceiling and the pillars itself. That's because they are not supporting it. That's right, they are there for show. actually see some paintings that I never thought I'd actually see in the flesh and we're currently inside the Windsor Guild Hall which is normally closed to the public it's the first time they've ever done this so on the 2nd of June and the 3rd of June they've opened it up a special open day we have these beautiful stained glass windows in commemoration of the Diamond Jubilee we have Windsor Castle, Buckingham Palace, Sandringham and Balmoral in each corner you have the famous brooch that Prince Albert gave to Queen Victoria the day before their wedding. It's also the same brooch worn by Queen Elizabeth II during her Diamond Jubilee. It opened in 1689 and you can see we are surrounded by beautiful paintings from monarchs over time. King George IV commissioned these beautiful chandeliers. Now fun fact, they were created by the architect and designer of Big Ben and the Houses of Parliament. So inspiring. Yeah, cool.